Hello everyone, hola todos, welcome to another Paso a Paso tutorial. This step-by-step -step tutorial is for Santuario, which is a student repertoire solea from uh, Paco Peña or his student repertoire. And I've linked the original version for you in the comments. And uh, this is a similar video as, uh, as or video series as, as for the Entre dos Aguas. And we are going step by step through this song. And this time I have tried learning to count and play at the same time. I mean counting, counting uh, for you. So counting while I'm playing meaning one, two, three, four, five, six and so forth. So um, I hope it helps in the learning process and uh, sorry for being this late I'm trying to aim for weekly videos on this series and uh, I'll try to try to keep up and uh, I hope you enjoy the series and I hope you learn the song it's an awesome awesome song so without further ado let's get started with it All right, so uh, let's just go cycle by cycle and I'll show you step by step how it is played. And uh, you start with the one and the first, well, let's start with the one, two, three. So the one, two, three would be one, two, three. So here you play, you use your thumb and your index finger and you have your fifth string and your third string and the third string uh, is on the second fret with your middle finger here and then you play third fret of the fifth string and you have your ring finger here and the first fret of the second string with your index finger here so this would be fingers a notch higher or like below here but the third fret and the first fret just like in here so one two three and this is important here you have a legato on three and it is played with your index and little finger here on the uh, first and third fret the first string. So one, two, three, and then you have your remate. So the four, five, six is four, five, six. So here you have one, two, three, four, five, six. And after that, you play it ex uh, almost exactly like in the beginning. But with, uh, in the beginning you play it like this. But now you play. So 7, 8, 9. And then again remate. 10, 11, 12. So the first cycle is. is of course your B e major here you only need these fingers here so one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten and then the second uh, second cycle starts the same with this Ring 
here on the third fret here. So one, two, three. Uh, uh, excuse me. One, two, three. And then you take this chord. So your middle finger on the third fret as well, on the sixth string, and your index finger on the second fret of the fifth string. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and here it's a remote, but with this, with this uh, chord. First fret of the sixth string and your middle finger on the second fret of the third string. And then you play the fifth string as well after like this. Okay. And from here it's basically a C chord, but you only take same uh, legato as in here, but you do it here. So. And then the normal, no, normal so that's basically the first two cycles. If we uh, wrap it up like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, the third uh, cycle and after the rem remate here you can leave this chord so from here you do a uh, arpeggio this goes like this so from this chord C chord. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So this one is here important. You have a C chord. string on the second fret so and let's count this a little bit so it's a little bit easier to understand so here's a one
So, so far we have hard to count so long okay so then uh, then starts the fourth cycle and this is a little bit the start might be a little bit difficult because you have to do a rasgeo like this uh, you have your e major chord here and for the whole the, for the whole cycle here you only need to use this chord here and then your little finger to the third fret on the fourth string. Okay, but you start like this. You do this rasgo, and basically after uh, when the cycle starts, it's like twelve. So what happens there? This rasgo starts before one is kind of uh, counted or it's hard to explain but the ups the the upstroke here like this one is basically the one so when you start 12 so you basically have on all the beats of the cycle you do this hammer on here and you do it with the ring uh, ring finger and mi middle finger strokes. and on the accents you do a index down stroke and a golf back you can actually practice it like this if you practice the cycle like important part is the, the rasgia in the beginning it might be a little bit difficult first so and after the golpe uh, or the sixth uh, the beat I usually like to change the hammer on into a hammer on and pull off which would sound like So it would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So the pull up and hammer on is like a, on, on the you do a upstroke with your index finger as well. So. Okay, and once you go through this cycle, so starts another cycle of course and this would be so that that is counted like this uh, you have this word and a C word just like uh, before but you have a normal rascal of uh, Little finger down, ring finger down, middle finger down, uh, index down and index up. And that would be one, two, three. So one, two, three, And after the three, 
you change to C chord and play Discord seven eight seven eight and here is the wait seven eight nine so nine is you 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 take this first fret of the first string so basically you have this chord first and then you move your little finger to to the third fret of the second string here and then in the end you move your index finger to the first fret of the first string and you play like this so with the down stroke of the index finger you do a pull off and after the nine nine ten eleven twelve and you end it on this string and a golpe, and that's because how it uh, how it uh, transforms from there to the to the last cycle of, of this video. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then comes the last cycle for this video. So, 10, 11, 12. For me, that seems to be really hard to play slowly, but let's try. So, to explain this, it has the same kind of thing as with because uh, this one, one three, here uh, instead of the rascal you have a tremolo here so it's index ring finger middle finger index and you have your thumb waiting here it's an E major and so you do this tremolo like So this is the content of this video and let's just wrap it up a little bit. So the first cycle was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then the second one. Then 12. 